welcome back. Today I want to show you some of the DIYs I made for fall and uh, a little bit uh, with Christmas uh, that's almost here, believe it or not. I know it's kind of early to talk about, but I thought I'd show you what I made and these are all products that I've used from Dollarama and Dollar Tree. So I went to Dollarama and I picked up a couple of pumpkins and they were orange, but I decided to paint them a light pink color with chalk paint and I bought some crystal clear gems from there and I hot glued them on the top, including the stem with pearls, and rhinestones, and I thought they turned out really, really pretty. So what do you think of this tray? I decided to make my own mirror tray I went to Dollarama and I noticed in the fall section they had these trays and it had Happy Thanksgiving written in the center. So I decided to spray paint it silver and then I bought these, these jewels. Well, they're like leaves and then they have like a rhinestone in the center and I hot glued them all around the edge on the top and at the bottom. And then I hot glued a mirror that I bought there and it's a really nice mirror actually it's beveled too so i thought i'd hot glue it in the center of the tray and voila your own mirrored tray how pretty is that how pretty is this pumpkin again i went to dollarama picked up a pumpkin it was orange and i decided to paint it white and then i painted these vine leaves on top and i bejeweled it and there you go. Isn't that really, really neat? I mean, so different and cute. I call this the vine leaf pumpkin. Here is another one that I made uh, using white chalk paint and uh, some gold beads that I just glued all around. And then I bought a pair of earrings from the dollar store and I took it apart and I hot glued each gem on the top and then I put some more of the gold beads at the stem. How pretty. How adorable is this pearl wreath? I went to the Dollar Tree and I purchased a wreath and I wrapped it in this satiny ribbon and then I bought a bag of pearls in different sizes and I hot glued each one on the wreath and I added some more satiny ribbon at the top for the hook and then I went into the hair section and I bought a girl's headband, believe it or not, and I turned it into a bow. I really like the fabric and the sheen it has to it. And in the center, I put some rhinestones to give it a little bit of bling. And there you go. Isn't that pretty for fall or for Christmas? I made another pearl wreath and this time I put a blue bow. The next thing I made uh, from Dollarama, well, some of it from Dollarama, uh, my mom bought these beautiful wine glasses and she purchased them for like a dollar. And I decided, okay, you know what? I'm gonna make a scene with them because they're big enough. And so I decided to put a little birdhouse and two birds, one on this side, one on this side. Isn't that cute? And I put some bath salts here and I hot glued some pearls on the roof and put a little jewel at the front and at the back. And I thought, how cute is that? A perfect winter scene. I then made a second scene with this wine glass and I put the bath salts again. And this time I just put the one bird sitting as if she's sitting in snow and I decorated the edge with some flowers and some silver beads. And I did the same with the bottom. And there you have it, another winter scene in a wine glass. And finally, I made this beautiful centerpiece or um, I don't know, it could be like for a wedding or, you know, or just to have it all year round in your home. Um, I like white, so I bought this beautiful clear glass bowl at Dollarama and I bought the pearls at Dollarama as well and uh, these flowers in the wedding section at Dollarama. 
and I put it all together and there you go. Isn't that pretty? You could put it on an accent table, a bathroom vanity, or you can use it at a party or for a wedding. Uh, it's up to you. Well, thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed my video today and if you do, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Have a great day.